Dead Island 2 could be released later this year. It has been claimed repeatedly that the game is close to completion. A journalist has explained that Dead Island 2 could be revealed soon and released later this year. Speaking on his podcast, Sacred Symbols, transcribed by VGC, veteran journalist Colin Mority, said, I bought this up a few weeks ago on the show, but Dead Island 2 looks like it's going to be revealed. He continued, I've heard from a source that I trust that the game may fully be revealed sometime this summer and released maybe shortly after that, maybe September or October at the soonest. Colin is the latest journalist to cite sources who have told them that Dead Island 2 is on the way. Industry insider Tom Henderson also claimed in February that Dead Island 2 is still in active development at Dan Buster Studios and could be revealed this year. Publisher Deep Silver's parent company Embracer Group also hinted during an earnings presentation that the game was still in development and may release during the company's next fiscal year which ends on March 31st, 2023. During a Q&A session in which the game was mentioned, Embracer CEO Lars Winchfuss responded, I can't talk about Dead Island 2 because it's not announced as such from the publisher, but we have just talked about that we have one unannounced AAA title that you think is Dead Island 2, so it's hard for me to comment further on that. But I am excited about unannounced titles, he added with a laugh. If the game were to appear soon, it could be at THQ's Nordics. Recently announced Digital Showcase. The company plans to present several brand new games, expanding the company's portfolio into new genres with both licensed and original gaming experiences. The show will also feature updates about THQ Nordic games currently in development such as Outlast 2 and Jagged Alliance 3. Dead Island 2 was first announced in 2014 and has since suffered a series of delays and changes of developer. It was originally in the works at Spec Ops The Line Studio Jaeger before development duties were taken over by Sumo Digital. Dan Buster, an internal Deep Silver studio, then took over development in 2019. Industry insider Tom Henderson also claimed in a YouTube video last week that he's been speaking to people close to the game's development, and that it's reportedly in a good state. According to everyone that I've been speaking to, the game is in a decent state, and it could be announced pretty soon with some kind of gameplay trailer, he said. A release date is expected somewhere in quarter 4, 2022, possibly leading up to next year if there are any problems with the development cycle. Henderson also provided some insight into the game's plot and its beginning. You're on a plane and there's a zombie outbreak in the plane. Eventually the plane crashes in Hollywood, you survive, then it's your job to survive on the ground. Thanks everyone for watching and I'll see you guys in another video.